everybody and welcome back to Andrew and Gabe. It's about uh, 3 o'clock right now and we're going to be doing something that we've never done before. We are trying Asian snacks for the first time. As you guys can tell, we are both Asian. Yeah. However, growing up, we never actually tried any of those Asian snacks that you see at like Daiso and Ranch 99. Our parents made us eat vegetables. <laughs> So Ranch 99 is basically an Asian grocery store. They have a ton across the United States, but they have a lot of Asian snacks in there. So we're gonna go in. Gabe's girlfriend, Mary, is gonna help us pick out some snacks and then we're gonna try them. So we'll see you guys in there. Uh, we just realized something. It's not called Ranch 99. It's called 99 Ranch. So, But everyone calls it Ranch 99, so yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, so we did find the snack aisle and now we're gonna pick out the ones probably like five or six that we're gonna try I feel so like uncultured. I don't know any of these snacks. All right, you got all your basic shrimp chips Ooh. lobster chips I think we will grab one shrimp Strips most of them are gonna be shrimp or lobster or some kind of seafood. That's what they go for. Ooh. These ones. Oh look, Mary's on the back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna grab the GG Wheat Crackers Original Flavors. Oh, these. You were not Asian if you didn't try these rice crackers. Well, I haven't. <laughs> They're rice crackers and they have little sugars on top and these were the best childhood snacks. We have three snacks so far. We need, I would say about 10 more. No. We'll do like five. Mm -hmm. Next up, we got these Hello Pandas. Ooh, I thought I said Hello Panda. <laughs> it has cream center with crunchy shell and it has a little panda po in the front. Look, a panda playing baseball. That's funny. <laughs> okay, next up, we got Pocky. There's Pocky, strawberry, Pocky. cookies and cream, chocolate, banana. Which one's the best one? Cookies and cream, of course. Ooh. Any of these? These. White rabbit candy. It has a paper on the outside that's actually edible. Ooh, edible paper, my favorite. All right, so we just finished up at Ranch 99. We got all of our snacks that we're gonna try, and we just grabbed these popular sodas that are called Ramoon sodas to wash down the snacks, and let's head out and eat. These are all the snacks that we bought at 99 Ranch. First, we're gonna try shrimp, Strips. Wow, try saying that fast. Shrimp, What's shrimp, inside shrimp, of shrimp, it? Shrimp, 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 shrimp. All right, ready? Cheers. See, I go all in, just like how I do life. Mmm. They like, like veggie straws. Yeah, like a shrimpy veggie straw. You guys have probably all seen this. A lot of people drink this. Very popular amongst the Asian community. I got uh, grape. I got blueberry. Blueberry. Like Mary, you want to demonstrate? So inside these little caps are these little plastic pieces you put this on top and you push it down really hard oh <laughs> wow that was cool you can see the balls now inside mm, that's hella <laughs> good try it so it tastes like a melted slushy like a watered down blueberry slushy mm -hmm. mine is grape oh that's good it tastes not too sugary it tastes like fizzy liquid syrup like cough syrup okay we're gonna try Want, want, Shelly Sun, Senbei. These are rice crackers. Ready? Oh, what the? <laughs> Cheers. Hmm. Honestly, it just tastes like a rice cracker with like frosting on top. Cool, it's like a little snack you could eat while you're watching mm -hmm. Avatar. All right, we're gonna try Pockies next. My friends used to eat these in high school all the time, but I never had one. Cheers. It looks like you could light this on fire. has more flavor. You got the like the cream and then the chocolate taste balancing out each other. This is like a perfect snack. This is good. These are wheat crackers artificially chicken flavor. I loosened it for you. It smells like a uh, funnel cake. Ready? Mmm. It tastes like top like dried top ramen. Fun fact we used to eat two bowls of top ramen every single day when we were kids. We gained like 30 pounds. I okay, actually these did. are the Hello Panda vanilla. What are these? They're like little cookies that are filled. Filled with what? Vanilla. Love. I'll take one chocolate frog. All right, ready? Mm. Cheers. Mmm. This is basically a cracker with vanilla frosting on the inside. Yeah. But I could see people snacking on these all. Like, I'm sure if you were in middle school, you can trade these for basically any snack. Last but not least, we have the creamy candy. Supposedly, oh, there's a paper inside that you can eat. Mm. 
No, no, not like that. <laughs> <laughs> There's paper inside. Uh -huh. Ready? <laughs> Cheers. I don't think you're supposed to eat that paper. I think it's all being with my mouth. It tastes like a white rabbit. It tastes uh, creamy and Almost, vanilla. Yeah, it tastes yeah. like milk. Like a milkshake. Like a milkshake and a candy. But now we're going to rank them and tell you which ones were our favorite. For me, I'm going to rank it from the ones I like the least to the best. At the bottom, I'm going to have to put shrimp strips. Next is going to be the... What are these? The rice crackers with the frosting on top. These are really good as well. Next is gonna be the ramen in a bag. Ooh, these ones are, this is gonna be tough. It's hard to compare because this is a drink. Maybe this one will go next. I would say white rabbit, and then I'm gonna go hello panda, and then hockey. Coming in hot <laughs> at number seven are these, the rice crackers. I'd say number four would be- Number four? How do you so, go from seven to four? The number six would be the shrimp strips. Coming in at number five, honestly, the Pockies. I feel like I, I could have had those before. Number four would be the milk candies. <laughs> number three would be the ramen chips. I call them ramen chips now. And coming in at number two would be, I really like this. So I'm gonna put the Hello Panda at number two. And at number one is the drink. This drink really tasted good, and I heard this isn't even the most popular flavor, so I'm super excited to try the rest of these flavors. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to comment down below what your favorite Asian snack is, or snack in general. And we do have a new video coming out soon, of course, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And if you guys are interested, we do have links to our camera equipment, filming equipment, lighting equipment, stuff like that down below. It is an affiliate marketing link, so we will get a little bit of a profit from it. So, until next time, we'll see you guys later.